Hey there and welcome to the Brain Checkers YouTube channel, India's largest career counseling company. Art history is the study of the complex relationship between art as visual form and a variety of historical factors that give rise to that form, condition its meaning, and influence its reception. Whatever the topic might be, you know already that art history requires memorization, titles, dates, and the artist's unique last names. Let's see the tips cured by Brain Checkers counselors. First, attend all classes. Learning about art history is like learning a foreign language, the information is cumulative. Missing even one class might compromise your ability to follow the professor's analysis or train of thought. Your best bet, then, is to attend all of the classes. Second, participate in class discussions. You must participate in class discussions. Whether you take your art history class on campus or online and whether the professor requires participation or not, you should contribute to analyzing the works of art and demonstrate your understanding of the readings as often as possible. The teacher will get to know you, which is always a good thing. You will receive immediate feedback on your art history skills, looking, analyzing, and remembering. Third, buy the textbooks. Buying the assigned reading material may sound self-evident, but in today's economy, students may have to cut corners on some of the more pricey volumes. Ask your professors for guidance here. Fourth, read the assigned readings. You must read in order to pass the course. In the world of art history, reading the textbooks and other assigned articles is crucial. One strategy you can use to become a better writer is to study your course readings make an outline of the flow of the text that you're reading. Every source you read will have an introduction and conclusion, but each author will have his or her own style of writing and argumentation. Read and remember what you read by taking notes. Fifth, Take notes. Memory often resides in the hand. Writing down information can lead to memorization with little effort. Take notes in class. Take notes while reading the assigned texts. Underline first and then go back. Summarize what you learned in your own words on another sheet of paper or on your computer. Organize your notes by topics. Make a timeline. Sixth. Practice using your textbooks website. Many textbooks have developed interactive websites that test your knowledge. Crossword puzzles, multiple choice quizzes, short answer questions, identification, and many more exercises might be available to play with, so look for these. Companion websites online. Seventh. Practice talking and writing about art. Art history classes often require essay exams or research papers, and because talking or writing about art doesn't always come naturally, this can seem like an exceptionally difficult task. With practice and patience, you can learn how to write about art well. If you are having trouble with memorization, one way to remedy this is to experiment with different study techniques like flashcards or style sheets. Giving each artwork you are trying to memorize a backstory can also help to make artists, artworks, or dates more memorable. You may want to enlist the help of your friends by having them quiz you. Here is a list that should help you to organize, prioritize, and earn good grades. With this we come to the end of our video, thank you for watching, if you loved this video please like, share and subscribe to us. Bye.